Welcome to our lecture online. Now let's discuss the difference between a power series and a geometric series, because quite often that is misunderstood. As we saw in the previous video, a power series can be written in the form the infinite sum from n equals 0 to infinity of c sub n times x to the n power. Notice that c sub n means that every constant of every term can actually be different. There are constants, they're called the coefficients of the series, but they can all be different. A geometric series can be written in the form, and notice the difference. It's the infinite sum from n equals 1 to infinity, so we start at 1 because here we have x to the n minus 1, but the constant in front of every term is the very same constants. All the constants are the same, and that is the big difference. Now, one more thing we should understand is that a geometric series is also a power series. It is a form, one of the forms of a power series. But the other way around, a power series can only be called a geometric series if all the constants in the power series are the same, which then also makes a geometric series. So the condition is that in a geometric series, all the constants are the same number. They do not vary, they do not change. But in a power series, all the constants can be different. They don't have to be different, but they can be different. And that's the major difference between a power series and a geometric series.